Welcome back, comrades, here in Inkpin, where we uh, increased our zoo capacity in the last episode and uh, did a little bit of touristical advancement by also crashes. getting in some jam in. As you can see, the need is slowly, uh, yeah, just stumbling in. We also increased our bread production and consumption, uh, and now those guys also want a botanical garden and a museum. And they also wouldn't mind the Docklands, and uh, yeah, has ended. we might actually uh, give it to them, uh, but not in this episode. In this episode, I have something different in mind, uh, and by that I mean something completely different, and actually something quite, yeah, the opposite to each other. What is this one missing? Is it the sugar? Is the sugar in in the meantime? Yes, it is. Six tons of sugar. That's going to be more and it's going to just hum along nicely. Uh, what we are going to do today is building some more ships and we're going to build some frigates because I do want to have a little bit of an expedition fleet. And we're also going to build some... Why are you looking that bad? Actually, no, you're not looking that bad. Okay. This was the ship that was looking that bad. Um, and I wanted to have a little bit of an expedition fleet to have some expeditions, for example, to get some, yeah, animals. And we already have a zoological expedition. I can't remember doing that. But you are probably wondering uh, since episode, I don't know, 25, when is he going to continue with that? Anyway, the broken mast, sailor under the mast. Yes, just... Yeah, just cut off his leg. No problem. It's just a mast lying on his on his uh, <laughs> on his knee. Double the mizzen mast. Oh, I'm actually, yeah, just yeah, cut off his leg be, because we do have um, the schnapps, but I think that's quite drastic. Anyway, I want to I want to do this rescue mission as well, and so on and so forth. And the other thing I want to do today is the Passa. Uh, the passage expedition and yeah we are going to uh, just check if we have a frigate for that because I don't want to what is the shooting about yeah okay oh nice I can get a get a little bit of flotsam um, if we have a frigate uh, free um, we should have uh, I think uh, those are clippers, those are ships of the line, and yeah, we have a frigate, the blobfish, and the Electra, and New orders, also the surprise wind. Actually, let's get the Electra and the surprise wind. Where are they actually? Oh, they're up here. Okay, that was probably pirate uh, securing and securing um, s a little bit of the seaways. Um, let's actually change that for ships of the line. Let's get a little bit of a navy in the middle over here. And also something over here. And let's have something over here as well. Just to be present in the area, you know. Um, what we could do is now get the... I mean, we got the frigates over already. At least we sent them over. I think and let's select the what was it called this frigate um, um, the old world definitely surprise wind I think it was the name independence it's going to be on the very bottom I assume no it's gonna be somewhere in the middle Surprise wind, where are you? There you are. The surprise wind, and we're gonna put in some thing for hunting. And that's gonna be coal, I assume, if we have. Yes, we do have a lot of coal. Let me check real quick what are the best uh, items. 
I've actually changed my mind a little bit. Uh, I'm going to take the Langustine as uh, the ship uh, of choice because it, this one is in front of Inkpin and in Inkpin we do have some fur coats um, which is good for hunting and also we are going to the Arctic so fur coats do make a lot of sense. There we also have the Midshipman. Uh, even though it seems like a witch, witch of women, but whatever. Um, which gives us extra navigation, extra force, and a little bit of naval power. We also have some schnapps with us for the uh, yeah for the rations and also for some health. And um, yeah, I'm thinking of uh, leaving this uh, slot open and just going ahead with 45%. I mean, we could we could go with uh, some crafting materials, maybe. Um, could also go uh, with with uh, some diplomacy goods, beer, for example, even though we don't have any, or some health goods. Soap is good for health. Do, does also olive oil soap work? Yes, it actually does. Um, yeah, I don't know what's good. What's good for crafting? Couchuk is good for crafting. We don't have that here. Um, we could also go with some sails. Do we have some sails? No, we don't. Could go with some timber. Timber is good for crafting as well. Yeah, let's go with some timber. If we uh, get the chance of getting an item, we can just throw this on board. So, so we have a fifty percent chance, and let's let's start the expedition. And while this ship is on its way, the Langustine, let's just have a little look at it uh, from closer closer up there we go with heroic music wonderful can i actually New select this Admiral. one and go into the movie view yes wonderful leaving ink pin off to new shores Accompanied by a little bit of dolphins and swordfish. Wonderful. All right. While this one is leaving, we are going to leave as well, but to a completely different area. Not to the cold of the Arctic, but to the son of Mbesa. Because I want to check our uh, tambourine city. We do have a lot of uh, paddles. And actually, I think the tea production is short. No, it's not. Okay. Forget what I said. What I want to do is to... Uh, get the get the quest moved on and also attend to the zoological expedition um, we can track the thieves town we should do that keep searching and finally tracks to follow and we're gonna yeah okay not find anything thank you for nothing um, yeah, we're gonna send the ship over and follow this uh, this quest, but we're also going to select those lighthouses just to attend to their needs. Um, I assume you have played it or or know a little bit about it, and I'm not going to pay so much attention to this uh, quest I'm, I can tell you the story a little bit it's basically a big empire and this is uh, yeah split up very very widely and um, Vahadesha was kind of the, uh, the uh, agricultural center uh, that suffers from drought and uh, the water is blocked and the Kedusi guys from Kedusi Antoni are basically the uh, yeah scholars. They are the smart ones. Have a big library under here, and um, those guys in Angareb, they are the pirates. They are basically the military uh, lead, and they used to be kings and so on and so forth. So those are basically the the parts to reunite. Um, we can also send them some clippers. Can we actually build a little bit of a, of a shipyard? No, we cannot. Can we do with the elders? No, not at all. So no ship building in... No ship building in Mbesa, but we can buy a ship. So we're gonna do that. Alright, um, let's check. Has the ship arrived? Now it does. Splendid! 
Come now, take me to this Katima. We have much to discuss. Yeah, the crown is trying to suppress already, uh, Mbisa. I wrote often enough, but communications in this land seem haphazard. New orders, Admiral. Meeting. Very well. And now we're going Although to go I back to Katima. Um, Let us nonetheless be civil and prepare a banquet. Let us not tarry then. No yes, I want to retrieve the goods from Fova Hadesha, and I'm going to deliver them. What they are going to want is um, us to supply them, and we are going to do so actually, because um, you get a really good item, multiple really good items, if you uh, fulfill all those quests and yeah, unite Vahadesha and so on and so forth. Um, I'm going to do that. Um, we're gonna have to deliver tapestries and dry meat, which is a problem because we don't have any tapestries yet. I, uh, I would greet our guest with try a to a not do that. Of our great land. But uh, yeah, now we have to. Come find me to discuss so we gotta build some some indigo farms. Can we build tapestries? Now we need elders for that. But we can build the other things. I would welcome you better. But even the patient Jack has deserted our island. Wahadesha is old. Some of his beauty yet survives. Follow Eban. He will show you. So we are going to build a little bit of a tapestry industry. Yeah, just like that for now. We have some indigo in, and then we are also going to build a little bit of a linseed and therefore, yeah, linen production. So we can all the have all the raw materials built over here in El Shaddai, and then we're gonna have the tapestries made in Tambourine. Yeah, that was a misclick. That's actually not that smart what I'm doing here. <laughs> but yeah, I need to move this one then. And this one needs to be deleted as well. It wouldn't take much to prepare. We'll have to find another way to pay. All right, there we go. Now we have it. This always takes a little bit. It's a little bit of tedious work. All right, we're gonna build a linen mill as well over here, and then we're just gonna have a little bit of a trade route going from El Shaday, new route from El Shaday to Tabarin, and we're gonna take the. Where is it? Those are not in basin goods. What is this doing actually? All right. Anyway, we're gonna take the linen and we're gonna take the indigo. There it is, and deliver it. And then we're gonna take a little bit of a ship. Yes, a little schooner from over from the Cape region, and it's going to be on its way. And we're going to move that to the Inbesa group, and then we're gonna have a little bit of a tapestry loom. Yeah over here Ship constructed. and then we can remove this road over here that's just basically annoying and sooner or later we're gonna have some tapestries and we're also gonna have some tried mead and let's just follow our bill and we also want to sail to Kitima's clipper over here to do the stories, the chronicle and stories of the land. Now we have to sail to Kitusi and Tony, so it is a lot of sailing around here. All hands at the ready. All right, let's check the zoological expedition again. The night in jail poisoned the guards, that's a good idea. Um, and we're gonna sneak outside. They are caught 
offer a bribe. Ah, no, that's not what I wanted to do. We're Damn it, I misclicked it. But we could have offered a bribe. A bribe. Oh, this sound is not looking, not sounding good. Oh, well, at least it changed. <laughs> I was afraid that the game will crash now. But yeah, it didn't, luckily. All right, the thriving markets and so on and so forth. The gates. Yeah, the old town over here basically, so... If you want to read that, you can so pause over here. Task with weaving our well intentioned, I'm sure, but I spent years studying this exceedingly complicated subject at Harvard College. <laughs> at Harvard College. <laughs> not not to uh, nice. uh, uh, switch up with Harvard. <laughs> were indisposed by my chroma, if you know what I mean. So I left, and more's the loss for them. So if you want to All read those little things you can do by Bible. pausing. Preferably a palatial library. The priests will grant you access, perhaps. I hope. And now we can select also the library. The library is restricted to servants of the Lord. The texts here are holy scripture, guarded from unsanctioned influence. The whole of Wahadesha stretches from here, land and law. Ask your question, Shema, and I will answer. Okay, find in Kendusia which is bland when but floating but delicious when sunk. Bibles, That's probably tea or something, yeah. Hibiscus battles, I assume. Or tea. Never Get in water. In uh, over, uh, over there I have to, yes, get something, yeah, ritual pool, it's the bags of hibiscus, yes. The hibiscus flower is the image of what we seek, here in Kidusi and Itoni. Knowledge Largest structure, like it's probably, yeah, the under Lord. here, probably, this ruins, on going down, now we can also like those things it's a little bit of clicking we turn to the right prices um we passed the first test and discovered our symbol the hibiscus tell me what did you make of it um seek knowledge to bloom yes quite accurate continue um you passed the test of sight and discovered the hidden roots of kidusi i'm just gonna just cancel that over there talking uh, me into my word um, the ruins of the old library now tell me what you make of it there's an ancient history of writing in Kendusi. It's more than ancient okay continue continue um, skills are intentional yes wonderful loyalty to Lord Ketema does you credit but we will not join him he is too narrow in his faith and I will not see Kedusi's legacy forgotten. You show yourself to be worthy of trust. Flip now the veil. All right, now we can also Very well, read let's about get to it. those All great things. All spring from a golden age, a time of splendor and legend. The books are over there. The golden age, there was the golden age actually. Strangers built this camp long ago. Brought tall ships from the north. And many all right I hope there'd be more but these are all the books we have hardly enough for a full chapter scholars disappointed now we can uh, ask about the golden age, the golden age. <coughs> there is much we could discuss untold perils await us Now we can also check the zoological expression. No, it's it's the, the, uh, quite different. It's the uh, Arctic expedition. So it's nice. Now we uh, do have this difference uh, that I was aiming for. Um, now, do we want to go west or do we want to go south? 
actually, let's go west. An Arctic welcome, and we can uh, do a little bit of uh, force, and we step forward. Wonderful. So now they're gonna get a little bit of schnapps and continue. What I actually uh, forgot is that Van Malching bought a share of Ikpen, and we have to buy that back as soon as we can, which is right now. And there we go. Let's get back to Enbesa. And I'm going to continue with this... Um, with this quest over here and uh, yes um, I'm probably going to finish it I'm going to buy a little Station. bit more of ships and yeah deliver Ever this of food and so on and so forth horizon. because this is quite of a tedious quest but I'm going to continue that and that's o only what I wanted to show ships. you that we are going to do that and yeah building and a little bit more and I also try to yeah combine all those nations and not to submerge them to uh, the emperor because oh, I'm against empires right because we're socialists in this playthrough so yes that's that's the plan for Anbesa and thanks for watching and People I'm going to see you in the next leadership. episode bye bye I don't suppose there are fountains no well perhaps some of those water furrows then <laughs> <laughs>